All right, so we're back in Mambazoo today. Um, and today I'm going to show you how to have multiple seed packets. I figured out a way to uh, to have more than one. Uh, normally, when you harvest a plant, it drops seeds, and those will join together and make one big seed pile um, instead of additional seeds. But um, this is an early access game. Um, you might lose your seeds. Uh, through the floor or through the ground at some point. Uh, it'd be a shame to lose a thousand potato seeds and have to start over from one. So here's how to make do uh, extra packets. So we have 10 uh, potato plants all fully grown. We have uh, 128 potato seeds right nearby. And if we harvest two of them, this is what normally happens. You harvest two of them you have this new seed drop there, and now it's 131 because you gained seeds when we harvested the uh, potato plants. Um, and if you keep doing this over and over again over the course of the game, you'll end up with hundreds or thousands of seeds, all in one drop right here. Uh, and if I drop it through the ground, perhaps it disappears, and then I got to go find more potato seeds and start gaining additional seeds over and over again. Uh, but I figured out a way to uh, avoid that. So we have 131 seeds here. If we take them and run them far enough away and dot them, say, here by the campfire, 131 seeds down here, run back up to the trailer and harvest the rest of these. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we have 11 seeds from harvesting uh, these eight plants. So now we have the 11 seeds here, and you can barely see the potato, 131 seeds down there. Uh, and for safekeeping, you could leave them down there, you could put them by the sugar shack, you could put them over the cottage, um, and maybe start growing additional uh, potatoes over there. Um, this works with the other plants in the game too, so um, this is just a quick video to show um, how to make extra seed packets. And I uh, hope this is helpful, and thanks for watching.